you know, we've got the pure tournament going on. What if he wanted a match under those rules? Under um, pure rules? Under pure rules. Yeah. I Yeah. Obviously. Yeah. I would, I'd be fine with that. It's not like I have like a thing against rules. I mean, I'd have to like look them up because I don't really know what they are, but. Okay. Um, Two yeah. seconds. We, we have Wikipedia. Hold on. Let's, let's take a look at those rules. Yeah. Bust them out. I'm sure I have no problem with them. I'm sure it's going to be a non-issue for me. Okay. So we've got, okay. So actually I got on Wikipedia. Okay. Okay. Uh, there's uh, looks like there's three rules. I've not. I've only watched like one of those matches. There's only uh, three rules. It seems like there is. I've. I remember when they had this title back in the day, like Samoa Joe had it, and then they went away, and now it's back. Uh-huh. Um, and I think. Uh, let's see. Each. Okay. So it seems like it's a modification of like Ring of Honor's original like rule set. Okay. Um. So it's each wrestler has three rope breaks to stop submission holds and pinfalls during the match. So three has, has how many? Three. Three, okay. Um, after a wrestler exhausts his rope break, submission and pin attempts under the ropes by the opponent are considered legal. Okay, sure. Um, two, there are no closed fist punches to the face allowed in a pure match. Only open-handed slaps or chops to the face are allowed. Punches to other parts of the body, save for low blows, are permitted. The first okay. use of a closed fist would get a warning and the second would cause the wrestler to be penalized a rope break. If he is already out of rope breaks, he would be disqualified. Oh, yeah, easy peasy. And um, a wrestler is subject to a 20 count by the referee if the wrestler goes to the floor. You get even longer to get back in? Well, that's like, it it seems like New Japan rules, because New Japan has a a standard 20 count. Yeah, I think, yeah, there's, there there are places, but that, so, yeah, what? Oh, okay. These are the rules that we're putting up on a pedestal. These are the rules that we're like. Oh. I don't. I don't know if he. I don't know if he's putting them on a pedestal, but I feel like this. This new Eel O'Neill again seems like he wants to impress his mentor, so he would want to compete under, you know, the the rule set that his his mentor cultivated, uh-huh. and and wrestles under and has won a title under. Yeah, that's great. Um, sure, sure, Eel. If that's if that's what you're going for, if that's what this whole stunt was about, you want me to agree. To a pure rules match, you got it, bub. Absolutely. I I <laughs> I wish you luck. I hope um I hope you do your mentor proud. But yeah, I'm game. I'll be there. 